Welcome to Wonderslate. Subscribe to our Telegram channel given in the description to updates and study materials. Topic for today's quiz is Forest and Wildlife Resources. Question number 1. Which of the following plays a key role in the ecological system? Option A. Rocks. Option B. Roads. Option C. Forests. Option D. None of the above. The correct answer is Option C. Forests. Forests play a key role in ecological system as they support large number of flora and fauna and provide natural habitat to the animals. Forests provide us many useful things for life. Forests have an important ecological function in fixing and storing carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. Question number 2. Which one among the following are not a part of the complex web of ecological system? Option A. Plants. Option B. Animals. Option C. Computers. Option D. Humans. The correct answer is Option C. Computers. An ecological system can be defined as the complex set of biotic and abiotic components which are interconnected with each other. Question number 3. Biodiversity is very important for which of the following creatures? Option A. Plants. Option B. Earthworms. Option C. Humans. Option D. Aliens. The correct answer is Option C. Humans. Biodiversity is important to humans for many reasons. Ecological life support biodiversity provides functioning ecosystems that supply oxygen, clean air and water, pollination of plants, pest control, wastewater treatment, and many ecosystem services. Question number 4. What percentage of the total number of species discovered in the world are found in India? Option A. 3%. Option B. 8%. Option C. 15%. Option D. 30%. The correct answer is. Option B. 8%. About 8.7 million is the new, estimated total number of species on Earth. Question number 5. Of the estimated 47,000 plant species found in India, about 15,000 flowering species belong to which category? Option A. Endangered species. Option B. Extinct species. Option C. Endemic species. Option D. Vulnerable species. The correct answer is. Option C. Endemic species. Endemic species are plants and animals that exist only in one geographic region. Species can be endemic to large or small areas of the earth. Some are endemic to a particular continent, some to part of a continent, and others to a single island. Question number 6. What percentage of India's wild flora and mammals are on the threatened list? Option A. 10% of recorded wild flora and 20% of mammals. Option B. 20% of recorded wild flora and 10% of mammals. Option C. 10% of cultivated species of flora and 20% animals. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option A. 10% of recorded wild flora and 20% of mammals. Some estimates suggest that at least 10% of India's recorded wild flora and 20% of its mammals are on the threatened list. Question number 7. Which of the following birds do not fall in the category of critical species? Option A. Pink-headed duck. Option B. Peacock. Option C. Mountain quail. Option D. Forest Spotted Owl
The correct answer is Option B. Peacock, critical, that is on the verge of extinction like the cheetah, pink-headed duck, mountain quail, forest-spotted owlet, and plants like maduka in Signes, a wild 2018-19 variety of mahua, and hubbardia heptane neuron, a species of grass. Question number 8. Which of the following is a species of grass categorized as a critical species among the threatened list of flora and fauna? Option A. Maduka insigans. Option B. Tamarindus indica. Option C. Hubbardia heptane neuron. Option D. Mangifera indica. The correct answer is Option C. Hubbardia heptane neuron. Question number 9. Determination The different categories of existing plant and animal species are based on which of the following agencies? Option A. The State Forest Department. Option B. International Union for Conservation of Nature and Natural Resources, IUCN. Option C. Forest Survey of India. Option D. Earth Summit. The correct answer is Option B. International Union for Conservation of Nature and Natural Resources, IUCN. The International Union for Conservation of Nature is an international organization working in the field of nature conservation and sustainable use of natural resources. It is involved in data gathering and analysis, research, field projects, advocacy, and education. Question number 10. The black buck belongs to which of the following categories of fauna? Option A. Extinct species. Option B. Rare species. Option C. Endemic species. Option D. Endangered species. The correct answer is Option D. Endangered species. These are species which are in danger of extinction. The survival of such species is difficult if the negative factors that have led to a decline in their population continue to operate. The examples of such species are black buck, crocodile, Indian wild ass, Indian rhino, lion-tailed macaque, sangai. Question number 11. The gangetic dolphin belongs to which of the following categories of fauna? Option A. Endangered species. Option B. Vulnerable species. Option C. Rare species. Option D. Extinct species. The correct answer is Option B. Vulnerable species. These are species whose population has declined to levels from where it is likely to move into the endangered category in the near future if the negative factors continue to operate. The examples of such species are blue sheep, Asiatic elephant, Gangetic dolphin. Question number 12. Which of the following species of animals is a rare species? Option A. Wild Asiatic buffalo. Option B. Gangetic dolphin. Option C. Indian Rhino. Option D. Black Buck. The correct answer is Option A. Wild Asiatic Buffalo. Question number 13. Which of the following species was declared extinct in India long back in 1952? Option A. Leopard. Option B. Gangetic Dolphin. Option C. Black Buck. Option D. Asiatic Cheetah. The correct answer is. Option D. Asiatic Cheetah. India was once home to many cheetahs, but the last of them was killed in 1947. It was declared extinct in 1952. It is the only large animal to have been declared extinct in India in recorded history. Question number 14. Which one of the following is not a major product directly obtained from the forests? Option A. Firewood. Option B. Timberwood and barks. Option C. 
medicines option d fodder the correct answer is option c medicines it includes timber charcoal kutchuk katashu wood oil resin natural varnish bark lac myra balance mahua flowers whether found inside or brought from a forest or not trees and leaves flowers and fruit plants including grass creepers reeds and moss wild animals skins tusks horns question number 15 Which of the following types of agriculture has led to wide scale deforestation and degradation of forests in northeastern and central India? Option A. Plantations. Option B. Intensive subsistence farming. Option C. Shifting cultivation. Option D. Commercial agriculture. The correct answer is Option C Shifting cultivation a form of agriculture used especially in tropical Africa in which an area of ground is cleared of vegetation and cultivated for a few years and then abandoned for a new area until its fertility has been naturally restored Question number 16 What is the Himalayan yew Option A A type of deer Option B A medicinal plant Option C a species of bird option d a food crop grown in the himalayas the correct answer is option b a medicinal plant the himalayan yew taxus wallacheana scientific name is a species of yew native to the himalaya and parts of southeast asia the species has a variety of uses in traditional medicine It is currently classified as endangered by the UN. Question number 17. Cleaning of forests is still continuing in Madhya Pradesh mainly due to which of the following reasons? Option A. Dolomite mining. Option B. Commercial plantations. Option C. Industrialization and urbanization. Option D. Narmada Sagar River Valley project. The correct answer is option D Narmada Sagar River Valley project question number 18 In which of the following year was the Indian Wildlife Protection Act implemented option A 1962 option B 1972 option C 1992 option D 1999 The correct answer is option B 1972 The Wildlife Protection Act 1972 is an act of the Parliament of India enacted for protection of plants and animal species Before 1972 India only had 5 designated national parks Question number 19 In which of the following years was the project tiger launched Option A 1951 Option B 1973 Option C 1993 Option D 2009 The correct answer is Option B 1973 Project Tiger is a tiger conservation program launched in April 1973 by the government of India during Prime Minister Indira Gandhi's tenure Question number 20 Which of the following species was included for the first time in list of protected species in 1991 Option A Insects Option B Fishes Option C Plants Option D Reptiles The correct answer is Option C Plants Thank you for watching the video. If you'd like practice this quiz then download the Wonder Slate app now. Link in the description below. If you have any suggestion for us feel free to leave comments.
If you liked the video and want to see more of it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to click on subscribe button to get more updates of the future videos.